welcome back to Underwater Math. I'm Sheriff Ali, and today we are working on our rounding skills out here in the wild wild west. Let's get rounding. Yeehaw! Let me get my lasso out here and we can round ourselves up a number, I hope I catch a big one. I see a good one out there, old number 976. Gotcha. Alright, let's round this bad boy to the nearest 10. This means round to the nearest 10's place, which for this number is the 7. When we round, we want to look at the neighboring digit. Our neighbor digit here is the 6. We have an old saying around these parts. Four or less, let it rest. Five or more, make it soar. Now this here digit is a 6. That's more than 5, so we need to make this guy soar. All that means is we make this 7 soar into a 8, and the 1's place becomes a 0. 976 rounded to the nearest 10 is 980. Now let's get ourselves an even bigger number. Let me get my lasso back out. Come here number number. We ain't gonna hurt you. There you are, I see you. All we want to do is round you. Gotcha. 2532. Now that's a big number. Now, we are still rounding to the nearest 10. Even though this number has a hundreds and thousands place, we can still round to the tens. We want to look at the tens place, which is 3. Now, we go directly to the neighbor next door. This here digit is a 2. Remember our saying, 4 or less, let it rest. 5 or more, make it soar. This is a 2, which means we need to let this bad boy rest. That means our 3 stays the same, and the 1's place becomes a 0. 2532 rounded to the nearest 10 is 2530. Alrighty y'all, you are ready to round numbers on your own. Good luck out there. Yeehaw!